The younger Eddie. <laughs> the younger, better, faster, stronger. So I think he's in MDBA area as well, so I actually invited him to our uh, event we're having in Baltimore. Oh, nice. Yeah, he seemed kind of interested, so we might see him. Cool. So this matchup actually, um, obviously one that I've playtested a lot because these characters were developed at the same time. I can tell you that Conquer, uh, his projectiles are not really good enough to compete with Wolf's. Wolf's laser is really good. Wolf's laser is really good and also it just comes out so much faster. Um, like you can throw them out so often. He has a reflector to deal with Conker's projectiles. Like you can throw the grenade out there, but Wolf's laser is just gonna hit it back towards you. So I don't really think this is a matchup where uh, Conker's got like control of the zoning with his projectiles so much. He has to kind of rely on his hitboxes more and use the projectiles for like edge guarding and just advantage situations in general. I made using the grenade recovery. Pretty cool. You'll like to see that. That's uh, one of my favorite little tricks that Kong can do with his grenade for sure. Really satisfying to use. Reavers evens it up pretty quickly with that back air though. And yeah, I definitely think this matchup uh, Due to that, like, sort of invalidation of Conger's projectile game that Wolf possesses, is sort of Wolf favored. This is this stage is like not that bad for Conker though, because Conker's crouch is very low, uh, and like, he can just like duck in that sloped area in the middle. Yeah, he doesn't get really low when he runs like a Pika or a Kirby, but the duck, the crouch is really low. Yeah. And then yeah, another thing Conker is really good at is just like edge guarding Wolf because you know, we talked about Wolf's recovery is pretty exploitable, and Conker is kind of like built for edge guarding. He has like, really good tools for that. So even just that neutral B, Wolf is dead. Yeah, Isaiah definitely a pretty notable Conker player at this point, even though he doesn't like compete. Yeah, I've seen him on a couple streams uh, playing Conquer. It's just really solid. I feel like he doesn't, he's not doing anything crazy. He's just really good. Yeah. And Jaime, anyway, as we expect. Super strong player. Knows these matchups, plays a lot of remakes. We'll see what Three Beers has to say about that. Uh, if he's gonna stick with the wolf. I don't know. Or maybe pull out the Bowser now. Bowser hey. definitely a character who gets a lot more zoned out by Conger's projectiles again, just due to having a big yeah, body, he's just big. large target, makes the slingshot especially good against him. And Bowser, of course, he has his own projectile, but it's a lot lower range than what Conger has. But it looks like Three Bears is sticking with the wolf. I'm not sure. I guess so. Thinks he can do it. This is winner's quarter still, so another best of three. And they're gonna play Cleanser? You can yeah, play win. Cleanser. So this is a new stage in the uh, 9.7 update. And it's one that's been added to the stage list. So I'm glad uh, I'm glad we're, we're seeing it. It got banned a couple times when I was playing, so I didn't get to go to it. Oh yeah. Yeah, definitely a pretty unique stage. You know, the platform layout is pretty simple. Uh, it has those sloped edges, like Yoshi's, and then these uh, blocks. I don't remember what they're called. Sorry, not a huge fan. I'm sure you can tell us. Oh, I don't. I don't think they really have that much of a name. <laughs> oh no. no okay. Well, anyway, yeah, those sort of blocks come out from the stage and add another platform underneath the ledge. But it's only there some of the time. And there's great music. Course, yeah. I mean, I always play on random music, so it doesn't affect me. Both looking a bit better this game, though. It's pretty even so far. Um, those little like platforms that come out under the ledge can definitely help out Wolf 
just by giving him another place to land with his up B. But if Conger is aware of it, you know, he still has the tools to punish that landing. Nice play from Three Beards there, just kind of waits until Jaime starts going for a grenade setup and jumps in over him. But uh, Conger was saved, of course, by the platform. Which was there for him at just the right time. Conger dash attack is pretty underrated. Yeah, it's a good move. It's pretty disjointed. It's really strong. It's only out for like six frames or something really short, but it's really strong. And it, yeah, it's disjointed as hell. It's looking like another uh, Jaime game, though. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> I think things were looking good for three years up until, up until the stage saved Jaime from that combo.